What's up guys and welcome back to the crew 2 today. We are gonna be what are you doing, bro? <laughs> Just running up in my shot today. We are gonna be checking out a brand new drift ride, baby. I'm excited and uh, let's see what we could do. So we've already done the event door and the Mercy Lago. Up next, this could be kind of cool. I'll think about that. Viper is a drift car, might be kind of weird. Corvette Stingray. Ooh, an old school Ford GT. That actually, dude, I'm gonna go with that. Let's do it. I'm down. That sounds pretty interesting. I like it. Okay, I'm gonna go with, um, I'm gonna go with yellow. I actually really like the yellow there. Let's go with these rims and uh, we're gonna go ahead and I guess, uh, I guess buy this thing with our money. We don't have any CC left, man. That's unfortunate, but we're gonna be okay. So yeah, we're gonna check this thing out. We got a couple of uh, drift races that we haven't done yet. And actually, let me show you guys, we might unlock the main street racing event here. We're at 64% out of 70% complete. So we'll, uh, we'll see what happens here. But uh, for now, let's just go ahead and go back to the Cribbo. And uh, we're gonna customize this thing up. It should be fun. Ooh, that was a weird like white and yellow combo on it right there. Do you guys see that? Like the yellow hadn't loaded in yet. So it looked like it was like poorly spray painted yellow. I don't know, it was weird. But uh, yeah, it should be good. Check out some uh, some drifting races. Sigs are fun. You guys have been enjoying those, so we'll see. Uh, we'll see what we're working with. So we're gonna go to drift for GT 2005 right here, dude. I'm not gonna lie, this thing looks sick. That's a big wing on it, but we'll take it. All right, we're gonna go ahead and customize, and uh, let's see what we have for liveries here. Typically don't go with anything. Ooh. Okay. We've got the racing stripes. We've got the racing layout. I really like the stripes. Although it looks weird. You guys see in the middle there? It looks kind of weird. I'm going to go with this. We're going to go ahead and apply that. And then we're going to change up the color. I think we're going to go for either more of a, a light, slightly lighter blue. Something like that. Dude, black would look really good too, I'm not gonna lie. Black would look dope. I wish you could change the color of the overlay because we could do like yellow with black stripes. Red doesn't look bad there, but we just did red. Oh, what about a lime? Dude, what about a lime like optic green? That's pretty sick. I'm gonna see what other options we have here. We could go for more of a purple or a pink. I like the lime green and we haven't really we haven't really messed with lime green. I'm gonna go with this one. All right, go ahead and apply it. Looks good to me. Let's see what we have for customization. So we've got hoods. Hmm. If anything, I would do this. But I kinda, I kinda like the stock hood. I'm gonna leave it stock. Front bumper, we'll definitely change this up a little bit. See what we're working with here. That's pretty dope, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna go with this. All right, go ahead and buy that. Looks good to me. Front fender. We'll put these things on there, why not? Rims. I feel like we might might wanna change up the rims a little bit here. I haven't even gone through all the rim options in this game. I'm just looking for something a little bit darker, I think. I'm seeing a lot of chrome and alloys and stuff. I don't think there's a way that you can change the color either. All right. Well, I guess we're just gonna leave it like that. Doesn't look bad. I just would've liked to darken them out. Caliper color. Let's go ahead and match it to the outside. Side mirrors. Those look good. I like those. Skirts. I guess we'll do it. Rear fender. Put some vents on there. I don't know why, but that just makes it look so intimidating, dude. The question is, do we want the wing or no? I think I'm gonna go no wing. You have to buy the no wing. I guess technically you would have to, to get rid of it, right? All right, lots of options here. So this is stock. I don't like that at all. This is kind of cool with like the exposed pipes and everything. 
I like that one. Yeah, I'm going with six. Boom. Looks good. And then interior. Let's go ahead and make this our own. I don't even know what I really want to go with here, dude. Probably the black. I don't know. Nothing else really makes a lot of sense unless we did the white and then made it mostly all black with white stitching, but the black pretty much looks like that anyway. So we'll leave it. All right, I think she looks pretty good. I think she turned out okay. Not the most customization options in the game, but uh, I keep going behind this stupid thing. Not the most options in the game, but I think she turned out pretty good. Honestly, this thing kind of looks like a Celine with the, the fender flares and stuff. A Celine S7. I don't know, that's the vibe I'm getting from it. But we're gonna go ahead and uh, hop into this thing, see what we can do. She's glowing in the sun. Yeah, dude, she looks good. I like how it turned out. We're gonna go and get our drift on and uh, and see what we can do, baby. But yeah, that, that like rear end is kind of looking like a Celine to me, but I think it turned out pretty good. I'm, I'm happy with how we did it. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and hop in and take a look at our activities here and uh, see what we've got going on. So we're gonna go, ooh, not hypercar. One thing I wanna show you guys, if you guys wanna see more of the racing in this game, it's gonna be crazy. Take a look at this hypercar race right here, New York. World record time is 28 minutes. So that means it's probably gonna be closer to like 35 to 40 minutes of racing just for one race. That's absolutely insane. So hold on, let's let's back out here. We're gonna go to drift. We've got two at the end here. So let's go ahead and check it out. See where we're going next. But yeah, dude, could you imagine a 40 minute race? Like, do you guys want me to do that? Could you imagine failing right at the end this and having to replay it? One of our own had his house burned down, so we're putting on an event to raise money for him. You're in, you got nothing to lose, and all the good karma in the world to gain. All right. So we're gonna be racing at Airport Terminal E today. Gonna be kind of sick. Let's see what we can do. This is a good looking car. Oh, dude, are you kidding me? Yes. Yes, please. That front end looks nice. We did a good job with it. Oh, got going a little bit too fast there, but we're okay. We had a nice little, nice little combo going too. I liked what we were, what we were throwing down there. This thing has a lot of power, bro. Oh my gosh, I thought we were gonna be able to keep that going. Now we're throwing big shapes, boys. We're getting real serious. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, that was a nice one. I was hoping we were gonna be able to keep it going, but when you start getting at, at those speeds, you just, you, you lose it. You're gonna go into the wall, there's no no stopping it. Even, even sometimes on the lower speeds, all right. So we had a really good run through there, let's try to do that again. Cause we're looking a little, I mean we're not looking bad, but oh shoot. We're not looking bad, but we're not looking great. We're running out of time here. We want to make sure we finish this. Do we get points for getting close to the wall? Because that was about as close as you could possibly get, dude. This section is so nice. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, we lost it. I was hoping to keep it going all the way through. All right, that honestly is one of my one of my more favorite drift tracks that we've done. That was just a good one all around. 65, 65, nine. Absolutely destroyed the uh, the competition there. That was not even close. We'll go ahead and pick up those parts. Not that we really need them. We'll go ahead and return to our free drive here. Here you made the list. And in the country. You get a gold star, and you know what else? 
It means you're finally worth beating. You won't be taking my place. Not now. Not ever. You talking trash to me right now, bro? I'm pretty sure we may have just ranked up to where we need to be. Hold on, let's see. Oh no, we're at 67%. We need to get to 70. So we aren't quite gonna be there yet, but uh, Red Bull Drift Challenge North. Sounds good to me. We're gonna go there and uh, I guess let's try to do it inside the cockpit of the vehicle. We'll see what happens. Dude, I, I just love this Ford GT, honestly. This thing's a lot of fun. Street racing is not just about racing, it's about style. And drift is about as stylish as it gets. Except, of course, if you're drifting someplace unique like Central Park Reservoir. Well, I'd maybe have chosen a different car, but style, I can't teach you that. Here we go, boys. Let's get it. We're going to try to drift this entire thing just inside the cockpit. We'll see what happens. I've got a feeling this one's actually going to be pretty tough. We'll see what happens. But I just feel like New York, like, it, we're not in, like, a, a contained area meant for drifting where we have the whole street. We're going to have, like, light poles and hot dog stands, as you can already see, and, like, benches and stuff. We're doing all right so far. Where are we going next? Okay. It's kind of hard to tell what's coming up next because we can't see much inside the cockpit here, but we're just going to do our thing. We're hitting almost everything on every corner. I think we got to slow it down just a little bit. Okay. Lost that multiplier like 70 times, but we're all right. Dang. We keep losing our multiple. Okay, you know what? You know what? I'm I'm retrying it. We're gonna do it outside the car. This one is is honestly, it's just a little bit too much for inside. You just you can't like you can't really see what's happening. You're kind of tunnel visioned when you're inside the car. Like in real life, I would be able to look out the left and right windows and see what was going on. But in, in video games, it makes it kind of tough. So we'll see if we can can get something going here. Already doing way, way, way better. Oh, I didn't see that pole there. I was setting up for a good entry on that corner and the pole, the pole ruined our, uh, our multiplier. That's all right. We're hanging in there. Whoa, stop, 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 stop. No, the bench. Dude, I, we were on such a good little link there too. Okay, this is about where we got to inside the cockpit. Trying to set this up. We've got one minute left. No! Oh, we're gonna be good. We're gonna be fine. We're up there, we're up there. Dude, this is... Honestly, kind of no joke. All right, we're gonna straighten this out. We're gonna come through and try to do one more little p pass. We actually don't have as much time as I thought. Oh, this is just some of these corners, they uh, they end up straightening way out more than you expect and you can't actually get sideways because you end up running into the hot dog people. We barely freaking got it, dude. Holy cow. That was actually really, really tough. And I think we made the right call not to race it inside. That one was hard. There are a couple corners where you're going sideways and then it just kind of like straightens out and you just, I, I don't know. It was weird. It was, it was not, not easy. That's for sure. We'll take it though. We got it. Took two tries. Closing in on number one on the list. But we got it. I know you'll get there. Just keep on keeping on. Tio's gotta be feeling the heat, cause you are all five. So you're top five on the list. I guess the list isn't what it used to be. It's up to me to clean it up. And 
put you back in your place. I mean, we'll see what happens, brother, but I, I don't think you're you're the hot stuff that you think you are. Are you ready to race now? No, you're at 69%. Um, drag Street and Drift are all done. Hypercar is the only thing that's left, and I'm, I'm not doing a 40-minute race right now, so we'll have to check him out in a future episode. For now, let's, uh, do we have motocross available? Yes. We've got some MX events. Let's do it, boys. So our recommended level is 22. We're going to have to rank up our bike a little bit, put some parts on it. Make sure we get it to at least 22. We learned the hard way on the drag episode. Who'd have thought that Lumberjack Tuck would have come out to race in a city like this? Can't wait to watch you send him back to the woods where he belongs. All right. I can't wait to either. But first, I'm going to have to grab my bike. The KTM right here. Is this... This is what I... Is it what I race on? I'm not sh is it? It might be. No, this is not what I race on. I race on a an actual motor. <laughs> Just kidding, this is the rally version. Where's uh Where's my K oh here it is. I was gonna say, where's my KTM dirt bike? That's what I'm looking for. All right, so we got this. Now we're gonna have to do some performance mods on it. Try to get it up to 22. That puts us at 21. That puts us at 22. All right, good stuff. Looks good to me. Here we go. Oh, the recommend. The recommended is 25. I've got a feeling we're gonna get burned here, but we're we'll we'll give it a shot. Three. And I think these guys are gonna be just like straight up way faster than us, but we'll we'll see what happens here. Off the bat. I'm gonna use my nitrous, try to keep up with them. I don't know, if we race smart we might be able to. We try to get first or top three? I mean, it's looking all right so far. He is right on our butt. I mean, if we take him out, then we should be fine, right? I wish you could in this game, dude. Just stick your leg out and kick him off his bike or something. Well, nobody said it was gonna be easy, boys, but we're we're gonna get after it. We're racing way underhanded right now. Whoo! That was a clean jump right there. Doing all right. That hurts. That hurts the speed a lot right there, dude. We're okay, we're okay, we're okay. There's just nothing we can do in those situations. We didn't have enough speed or enough nitrous to do anything. Woo! You got tucked right where you want. Behind you. Back at first. Y'all wanna hop in? Hop in on the handlebars? I'm down. Dude, this is kind of insane. Oh my goodness gracious. We're all right. What is this, back to the, the start? Gonna run the entire thing again? We'll stay up here in the first person view for a minute, but then we're gonna hop back out to third and hope that we can actually, actually win this thing. We're two seconds ahead right now, but these guys will catch up quick. I really want to backflip off of that, but I not not in this race when we aren't going to really... We're already at enough of a disadvantage. I want to make sure we stay ahead. That was a clean turn right there. We're almost going too fast now. We're like overshooting into the next... 
The next jump set. Oh, that was nice. We're okay. Perfectly executed right there. Uh, the last one wasn't as good, but we're okay. That one messed us up both laps. Sorry, got some place to be. Watch out, bro. Woo! Your boy is out here making moves with a bike that's less effective. We're good. We're good. We're good! Yes, sir. That was clean all the way through there. Just have to hold him off for the finish. Holy cow, dude. Whew. We only had to get top three. I, I was out there trying to get first, though. I mean, we couldn't, we couldn't keep up with these guys in the drag races, but I guess we can do it when we're on the bikes. Got a couple of parts here, a couple of upgrade parts. Hopefully, this is gonna. I don't know what you're thinking or who you've been listening to, but I'm not liking what I'm seeing. I helped you get this far, and yet I feel like you're walking away from me. You took advantage of what I could do for you, and now you're going to leave. Show me that I'm going What are you talking about, bro? Oh, we messed it up. Uh, I'm hoping these parts are going to put us in a better spot. Let's see here. Is this going to get us up to a 25? Puts us at a 23. 24. I mean, that's that's more understandable. So let's go ahead and run one more here. And uh, we're going to finish off the... Finish off the bikes. Finish off the uh, the motocross well, here. Well, well. Look who's a big shot all of a sudden. Let me tell you a secret, my friend. I taught you everything you know about motocross, not everything I know. So I'd say my record's safe. And that sound you hear? It's the seconds ticking away until you lose. <laughs> but good luck trying. You know what? I say we do it in first person too. We're gonna do it like we're actually riding a trail out here. Holy cow. It's a little bit foggy, kinda hard to see, but let's get it boys. Off to a good start here. Oh baby. Do we? Do we? We do. We go for the backflips. I'm out here about the clips, not only about the wins. I see you back there, though. Hanging in second place. That's cool. Dude, this would be terrifying. We are going 90 miles an hour on a dirt bike. One little twig or bush or rock or anything out of place that you hit wrong. I, I mean, that's it. GG. Nice to know ya. Or tree. <laughs> we just did a tree right there. Oops. Sorry. Okay. We had a second tree. Are you serious right now? It... Whoa! Alright. He's about it. Let's go. Still trying. Let's go. Okay. Apparently we're hitting every tree. I feel like I'm just being magnetically... Baited towards them, like attracted towards them. It's weird. This is a, a cheeky little shortcut. Yes, sir. Whoo! I like how we hit the shortcut right as the beat was about to drop. That was awesome. Dropping off through here. Getting a little sideways. Oh, he's still with us. Okay. I mean, he does have a better bike after all, but we're not gonna use any excuses here. Come on, it's all downhill from here. We are barely in front of him right now, boys. Oh, we were able to beat him out at the end, though. All right. Whoo! 
Honestly, that was a little bit closer than I expected. I'll give it to him, but that was... Look at our character, dude. Just covered in mud. That is awesome. That was fun. I enjoyed that. We're going to go ahead and grab these pieces. And uh, I'm going to call that a great episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. The thing is, you really want to understand this country, you've got to get down and dirty with it. Get on a first-name basis with Mother Nature. Ride cross-country like I did when I turned 17. You'll see. There's so much more to this place than just the cities. More than tourist traps built on parking lots. And you've got to come out here and see it all for yourself. North to south and sea to shining sea. Sea to shining sea, baby. All right. Well, Tucker Tuck Morgan has been, been unlocked. Oh, wow. Rival. So we're going to be able to take on the Street Racing uh -oh. King and we can take on the Dirt King. That'd be kind of cool. He sounded really ticked off. Think it's something we did? Might be. All right. I'm going to see you guys in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Catch you all later. Peace out.